there was like a Nintendo Direct like 50 minutes ago. But I didn't record it because the first thing in my mind was, oh, mode of goddamn long. Because uh, I'm going on a family vacation. I'm leaving for a family vacation tomorrow. And it's going to feature like 12 of us. Uh, me, my parents, my sisters, and their families. So it's a number of 12. So I want to mow the lawn before we leave tomorrow. My one sister is leaving, is going to be with her family from Georgia, and we're going to meet her there at the destination. My younger sister is going to be with her family in a car, and I'm going to be carpooling with my parents. So, uh, you know, I don't have to drive separately. Jesus Christ, my is my. What internet browser I can go so goddamn slow? This is 25 minutes, looks like it's 26. Nothing is spoiled on the side. All right. When mankind is consumed by darkness and the land falls into chaos, the archdemon of the abyss shall rise from the earth. They come rushing here in a desperate attempt to survive. Both beast and man. Why is the quality 144? I'm not watching this live. I'm watch. Hold on, let me switch this over to 360. At least, like, why is it so goddamn blurry? Like, why the 144p? Seriously. At least 360. Yourself. Is this Monster Hunter or something? I'm pretty certain there was a Monster Hunter game that was announced like earlier this year or something. Another begins. Wandering flames. I see you found your home.
Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. In this presentation, we'll be focusing on Nintendo Switch games launching this year from our publishing and development partners. Okay, let's get into the headlines. Surprise me. The battle to reclaim Earth begins. The year is 5012 AD. Machine life forms have overwhelmed the planet, causing the collapse of civilization and forcing humans to take refuge on the moon. Now, with an android squad called Yorha, the humans are prepared to stand against these machine life form invaders. Glory, stand by. A battle android 2B and a scanner android 9S are two key members of this squad. So you're saying we can look at 2B's ass on the Nintendo Switch? Life forms in conflict with androids. What will come of this bloodless battle? You just die already! This version of the award-winning Nier Automata comes with previously released content, including additional modes and costumes. New costumes exclusive to the Nintendo Switch version will also be available at launch. Reclaim Earth in Nier Automata, the end of Yorha edition, launching on the Nintendo Switch system October 6th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Get ready to immerse yourself in surreal riddles and a chilling story in this modern take on puzzle adventure games. Solve the enigma of Lorelei and the Laser Eyes, launching first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next year. Familiar faces are making a splash in these games. A new Bomberman game is coming to Nintendo Switch. This time, a bombastic new mode called Castle Mode enters the fray. A team of up to 15 players must blast their way to treasure chests, while one defending player tries to hold them off. Set up your defense wisely to blow away opponents, literally. You can also create and share your own battle stages. Have a blast when Super Bomberman R2 launches on Nintendo Switch next year. 10 Mega Man Battle Network games originally released on the Game Boy Advance system are coming to Nintendo Switch. Control Mega Man in grid-based combat and use battle chips to gain devastating abilities. This collection includes a gallery with over 1,000 illustrations and a music mode containing over 150 songs from across the series. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The full collection will also be digitally available as Volume 1 and Volume 2 each sold separately. A remake of Pac-Man World is coming soon. Pac-Man's family have been kidnapped. To rescue them, he sets off for Ghost Island. Eating dots isn't all you can do here. Trounce enemies with pack dots, the rev roll, the butt bounce, and a giant Pac-Man? From high-speed chases to galactic escapades, you'll explore all sorts of zany levels. Save the pack fan in Pac-Man World Repack, launching on Nintendo Switch August 26th. Two unlikely friends, one incredible journey. A fawn and a wolf cub must work together to find a way home across the snowy wilderness in the handcrafted world of Blanc. Yeah, this looks like something that would have been on Indie in Showcase. This emotional adventure. These unlikely friends must coordinate and use their individual strengths to solve environmental puzzles and navigate through the frigid wilds. 
Blanc is a completely text-free story with local and online co-op play, so all players can enjoy it. Forge an unexpected bond in Blanc. Launching as a console exclusive on Nintendo Switch, February 2023. Arr! A swashbuckling adventure returns. Monkey Island? Pirating is in my blood. Like adrenaline or stale grog. I've been in enough scraps to fill a dozen scrapbooks. I've got stories about ships, fights, love, treasure, betrayal, and root beer. But how about one that has all of the above? My name is Guybrush Threeport, and this is a story about the time I finally found the secret of Monkey Island. I brush three wood. Monkey Around in Return to Monkey Island, launching first for consoles on Nintendo Switch this year. Next, we have some news about a game that was announced last June. Please take a look. Really? What was that? Mario and the Rabbits blast off for a galactic adventure in the latest Mario Plus Rabbits game. Space is in a universe of trouble when otherworldly enemies suddenly appear. Their goal? Take the energy possessed by Sparks, these mysterious creatures. Now, our heroes must set out to save them. A new adventure of epic proportions awaits. You'll initiate a turn-based battle when you encounter an enemy. Before we begin, here's something you ought to know. You can freely move around the battlefield as much as you'd like within your character's range before using their weapon. Pretty neat, huh? Let's start with Mario. Three enemies are in the way, so let's dash into one of them. Now select Rabbit Rosalina and have her dash into another. Next, Rabbit Luigi. One more dash, and now, Disruptor time! By using a dash first, then the weapon, three enemies were wiped out. With that, his turn is over. Back to Mario. Let's take out the other two. Pew pew! That concludes his turn. Last but not least, Rabbit Rosalina. Team up with an ally and jump! Get position, then finish off with the Kaboomer. Okay, our turn's over. And now, the enemy attacks. Be sure to take cover, and you might be safe. If you don't, it won't be pretty. All right, we've got the floor again. Dash toward the Babom, And if you chuck it over... Boom! That'll do it. The key to victory is how you assemble your team and navigate around the battlefield. Wait, is that Bowser? And he's joining the team? Mario plus Rabbids Sparks of Hope rockets onto the Nintendo Switch system October 20th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. 
Check out Ubisoft's special showcase tomorrow for more details about Mario plus Rabbids Sparks of Hope. Hmm. We hope you're looking forward to the chaotic adventures of Mario and the Rabbids. Let's take a look at more headlines. There's something for everyone on Nintendo Switch. During a storm, young alchemist Noah crash lands in ancient ruins. The layout of these multi-layered ruins changes every time you enter them. Recruit allies called Lilliputs to challenge the enemies lurking around every corner. String together combos and perform powerful elemental attacks to defeat foes. Little Noah, Scion of Paradise, launches on Nintendo Switch later today. All aboard! In the management sim Railgrade, you'll build railway systems to efficiently transport cargo and help restore economic prosperity to an industrial colony. Complete various tasks to prepare each shipment before it's delivered to its destination. Your strategies will change based on various factors, like the number and length of trains to run, which resources to acquire, and how to transport cargo from point A to point B. Railgrade steamrolls onto Nintendo Switch this fall. Join aspiring game creator Kenta in a hand-drawn adventure to save the world in his latest creation, The Legend of Wright. Taking place in Kenta's notebook, this RPG spans over 200 pages where you must draw, erase, solve puzzles, and even consult your handy calculator. Discover a new way to play every time you turn the page. RPG Time, The Legend of Wright unfolds onto Nintendo Switch August 18th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Spin Dash into a new zone. Sonic's latest action adventure kicks off on the vibrant Starfall Islands, home to a mysterious civilization. Here, you can freely dash through a vast open zone, taking full advantage of Sonic's speedy skills. Lock on and attack enemies standing in your way. Chain together attacks to trigger combos and rack up damage. With good timing, you can even deflect enemy attacks. Acquire skills to bolster Sonic's arsenal of moves. You can also enter a special zone called Cyberspace. Take on challenges at supersonic speeds and grab keys to progress. What awaits Sonic on these strange islands? Sonic Frontiers dashes onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Live magically alongside your Disney and Pixar friends. Is this um Dreamlight Valley was once an idyllic land uh. where Disney and Pixar characters lived in harmony until the forgetting turned this dream into a nightmare. Now, it's up to you to help these iconic residents recover their lost memories and reveal the secrets that led you here. Bring the magic back to Dreamlight Valley in this mesmerizing life simulation adventure. Explore this land's many diverse realms and forge lasting friendships with heroes and villains alike. Everyone you meet will have personal stories to discover and adventures to complete. Help them out by exploring, giving them gifts, and performing other fun activities. In this world, you can be whoever you dream yourself to be. Disney Dreamlight Valley launches on Nintendo Switch September 6th as an early access title. Take these adventures with you on the go. I'll check out Disney Infinity. That was that's what I was Life thinking of. Is coming alive on July 22nd. Multiple stories featuring different protagonists, time periods, and gameplay await. Now in HD 2D. A demo with the start of three. I tried a lot. I tried live a lot. Uh, was not a fan of the gameplay. The distant future will be available on Nintendo eShop later today. 
Save data from the demo can be transferred to the full game once purchased. Doraemon, Nobi, and their friends land on an unknown planet and decide to help a new friend fulfill his dreams by farming, plow the fields, harvest crops, and tend to the animals. You can even use Doraemon's secret gadgets to farm in a flash. Relax by living with friends, eating delicious meals, and fishing. And with local play, you and a pal can build a ranch together. Doraemon Story of Seasons, Friends of the Great Kingdom launches on the Nintendo Switch system this year. The world of Minecraft meets action strategy gameplay in Minecraft Legends. A beautiful land surrounded by rich nature is invaded by enemies from another dimension. Team up with allies and fight against this monstrous force threatening the world. What secrets await in this new yet familiar universe? Minecraft Legends launches on Nintendo Switch next year. It's a treasure hunt. All right. Paradise. Two siblings dream of collecting grand treasures from around the world. Venture to the realm of Draconia to become legendary treasure hunters. In this Dragon Quest series spin-off, you'll recruit a variety of well-mannered monsters to join you on a marvelous adventure. With their help and with your trust. Are you going to ask Dragon Quest 10 after this? to reach high ledges or dangle from a drachy to glide over gaping chasms support your monsters in battle as they fearlessly fend off foes bring your hard-earned haul back to your base and see how much it's worth collect more riches to expand your base and increase your treasure hunting level x marks the spot when dragon quest treasures launches on nintendo switch december 9th ah december looks like I know I'm gonna have to censor some music here. Yeah, Fire Emblem Warriors. No Man's Sky, who gives a goddamn? More like No Man's Game. Yeah, that looks like a strategy RPG. We're going to have so much fun together. At first, your participation is appreciated and required. There might even be cake. The Portal Companion Collection will be available later today. Yeah, I know that this was announced uh, a few months ago. But oh well. Let's get started, you monster. Is there something else? Farm, fight, and forge friendships in a new fantasy world. Welcome to Leafy. A piece of oh, Harvestia? Harvestella? I was expecting something like Rune Factor or something. Brand new life simulation RPG. Do a little farm work. Cook and craft items. And trek through the fields to collect materials. All while meeting townsfolk along the way. The seasons gently flow from spring, summer, fall, and winter. However, they will give way to the season of death. Quietus. Crops wither. Life is threatened. Find a way to stop the season of death from wreaking havoc on your home.
fate of the village depends on you. Begin your new life in Harvestella <sighs> on Nintendo Switch November 4th. Okay, now there has to be like one more game. Yep, last announcement. Ooh. This is a uh, Persona 5 scramble, right? Wait, it's reigning ace of the Phantom Thieves of Parts. And today, I'm bringing along an ultra top secret video. I hope you're ready. This is Persona 5 Royal? Yeah, it's Persona 5 Royal. Is it Persona 4 Golden? Check this out. Is it? Yes! I do not have a PlayStation Vita. So I was like, how am I going to play this game? Like, because this is, this is the only game on the Vita that I want a Vita for. And I just didn't want to get a Vita for one game. Shut the fuck up. I mean, I have PlayStation. I have Persona 3 Portable. Well, like, yeah, I don't have Persona 4 Golden because I don't have a Vita. Keep your eyes peeled for more okay, you just blew my mind, Nintendo Direct. Ah, now I can finally get around to playing Persona 4 Golden. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Although, I wonder how much different Persona 3 Portable is from the PSP version, because Persona, uh, Persona 3 Portable is not that impressive visually compared to Persona 3. Oh, jeez. I'm trying to close this. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> uh, I don't think I'll be able to, I don't think I'm people gain a Persona 3 Portable, but Persona 4 Golden and Persona 5 Roll is definitely a get. So uh, if there's anyone watching like the video, please subscribe and have a nice day. Bye.